do lemons make pasta? <laughs> Christina here. In this video, my mom and I show you how to make a refreshing lemon pasta dish. First, let's prep our fresh ingredients. Chop one half cup of fresh parsley plus two tablespoons and put it aside. Next, you want to take one large lemon and zest it and put it in a small prep bowl. Next, you want to juice lemons enough for three quarters of a cup and put it aside. This is about three large lemons. After that, you want to use or grate one half cup of Parmigiano cheese. And the reason why we use Parmigiano cheese instead of the Romano cheese is because the Parmigiano cheese is a little bit sweet, so it offsets the tartness of the lemons. And now for the garlic trick. This is my favorite part. Take one clove of garlic, peel it, and cut it in half. Put the cut side down and rub the garlic all over the inside of a bowl, which is large enough to hold one pound of pasta. It will feel sticky at first, but then as the garlic rubs on, the bowl will become a bit oily and slippery, and this is what you want. By doing garlic this way, it adds a subtle flavor without being too powerful. Next, get the water ready for the pasta and set the pot over high heat. While waiting for the water to boil, it's time to make the lemon sauce. To the prepped pasta bowl, add all of the freshly squeezed lemon juice and whisk. Next, pour in half a cup of extra virgin olive oil and whisk it into the lemon juice until it emulsifies. Then, whisk in a half a cup of chopped fresh parsley, reserving the extra two tablespoons for later. And finally, add a quarter cup of grated cheese, saving the rest of it for later as well. The sauce should look like this when it's done. By this time, the water should be boiling or close to it. Pour one pound of pasta into the water. Here's a cool trick to see if the pasta is done. Cut it in half and notice if there are any white spots inside of it. If it's white, that means the pasta is still raw, so allow it to cook for a few minutes longer. For this pasta here, you can still see a tiny bit of white on the left and right side of the circle. When the pasta is finished cooking, place it in the bowl with the lemon sauce and give it a good stir. It's best to use a strainer like the one shown or a slotted spoon. The reason we don't drain it completely is because the starch from the pasta water, which is still clinging to the pasta, acts as a sauce thickener. Next, add the remaining quarter cup of grated cheese, the lemon zest, and the two tablespoons of the parsley. And you're done. Pair with your favorite wine and enjoy. A perfect dish for summertime. What is your favorite ingredient in this pasta dish? Let me know in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up and remember to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on our future videos. Ciao for now. Can you do it, Mom? No, I can't. Stand on your tippy toes. I did, I can't. <laughs>